What's going on YouTube? Richie here guys and today I have another video game unboxing for you guys and that's Dead Rising 4. Not only that, since I got this game at GameStop, it came with this exclusive Dead Rising 4 Frank West Holiday Snow Globe. You know, that's, that is a mouthful so I don't know, you guys know me. Um, I always love it when, you know, when GameStop gives you all these little extra goodies along with your game. So just real quick guys, before I unbox this, you return as Frank West. He hasn't been playable since the very first game. And that first game, I kind of did enjoy it somewhat. What I didn't like was the save feature. It was really awkward, but it was a pretty good game overall. Part 2 was okay, but I really did like Dead Rising 3. I know a lot of people didn't like it or gave it a lot of flack, but I thoroughly enjoyed that game. I thought it was a lot of fun. Now before switching to my top download that I usually switch to, I'm just gonna go, ahead and, gonna go ahead and unbox this for you guys real quick with my handy dandy pen cap because I always lose my handy dandy screwdriver or my handy dandy tool to unbox these things. And let's see here, make that incision right there. Styrofoam up, already making a styrofoam mess. I'm gonna have to bring the vacuum cleaner in here. I just vacuumed the other day. All right, so getting it out of there. All right. Now <laughs> the styrofoam. All right. So this is a little bit, oops, moving the camera around. <laughs> All right, so this is a little cool. I mean, not too impressive, but let's see. You know, Dead Rising 4 has like the Christmas tree with the Santa Claus. Uh, Santa Claus has says Dead Rising 4. I'm not sure if you can see that, but it has Frank West's camera right there. And it has like his baseball bat covered in barbed wire, which had, lead, had a lot of people to joke around that he's like Negan from The Walking Dead. That's his name, right? I don't know. I don't watch that show. All right, guys, now I'm going to switch to the top down mode so I can unbox Dead Rising 4. And maybe you guys can get a little better look at the snow globe. All right, let's take a better look at the snow globe real quick. I'm not sure if you guys saw it earlier, but there's Frank's camera. There goes his barbed wire covered bat. And there's something I didn't notice right off the bat, but that's a present with a zombie head in there. <laughs> you guys can see that. That's that's pretty cool. All right, guys, so here we go. Unboxing Dead Rising 4. And before we do that, let's just take a look at the cover. Of course, we have Frank West in all his badass glory with his barbed wire <laughs> covered baseball bat. He is a photographer. He is a journalist. So, of course, that's why he has the camera. And, of course... This, remember guys, this has like this has a Christmas holiday theme, which I think is pretty cool inside of the mall. Which looks pretty awesome. Here on the spine, of course, at Dead Rising 4. And let's take a look at the back real quick. Let the sleigh ride begin. Frank West returns 16 years after the events of Dead Rising to investigate a new zombie outbreak during the holiday season. And that's gonna look like a lot of fun. Look at all these, look at all these screenshots right here, guys. It looks awesome. And of course, it's only one player's. Uh, co it's not couch co-op, which is disappointing. You guys know me. I love it when games are couch co-op. I mean, you can't play up to four people on Xbox Live, but it ain't the same. All right, guys, for use only just real quick, it's going to be 45 gigs of storage required, which is pretty hefty, but it's to be expected these days. And of course, right now, guys, you can only play this game either on the Xbox One or on PC. And I don't think the PS4 is going to get this until probably sometime next year. Kind of the same deal with the whole uh, Tomb Raider uh, deal from last year. All right, guys, let's just unbox this real quick. My handy dandy pen cap. Get that right off of there. Bring it up. Let's see, I have to make a better incision than that next time. I really do miss that screwdriver. I have no idea where I placed that thing. The good thing it was pretty sharp, and anyways, enough of me reminiscing about a freaking screwdriver. Uh, let's get that shrink wrap right off of there. Make sure that there's an extra tape around the top. Alright, opening that up. And of course, guys, a little disappointing upon opening it. The reason why there's like nothing here, no booklet, no R, no little extra flyer or anything. You guys know me. It's the small things that count. And so that's a little disappointing, but I can't complain too much. And here's the disc. But what I do love is the disc card on here. Just look at this. You know, a lot of video games, the disc card tends to be boring. But since Frank West is a photographer and since, you know, selfies, you know, are the, have been, you know, popular for the last couple of years now, it's only natural that they incorporate that onto the art. And that looks cool, look. Yeah, that, that's pretty funny, actually. It's pretty humorous. No matter, no matter how you feel about selfies, this looks pretty humorous and looks pretty cool. So I'm really loving the disc card on here. And of course, what else, the other thing that I'm loving about this, guys, at least I'm boxing this, is that the, as I get this out, <laughs> is that the case is actually hardcover, not the hollowed out recyclable ones. You guys know that I really do appreciate that. 
Well, all right, guys, that just about does it for this unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. You know, get all that stuff in there because I really do appreciate it when you guys do that stuff for me. I really do, guys. And as always, I'm Richie. Stay tuned, and I hope to see you guys on the next video.